Hi there, I'm Dr. Wise. You wouldn't know it by looking at me, but I have a special gift. I got it on my seventh birthday, X-Ray Eyes. Now I can see through anything. I've explored all kinds of places, and I used my X-Ray Eyes to find the most amazing things. Try them on. To start a brand new game, click on any of the game markers that don't already have a name. Then type your name or initials to start. Click on the picture with your name on it. Or hit the return or enter keys to start a new game. Click on one of those special places on the map, and we'll go look around there. Click on the sun to see who created this game. Hmm, you'll need a little more practice exploring other places before you can visit here. This toy factory is loaded with toys. That's the market where we shopped. That's the market where we shopped. On this stage, a magician makes magic. Whoa, you'll need to play a few more times in other places before you can visit this place. You can explore this place after you play a few more times in the other great spots. You can explore this place after you play a few more times in the other great spots. To have fun here, you'll need a little more practice playing in other places. I learned all about cereal in this supermarket. Newt the Neutrino here, reporting for duty. If you need help, I'm your particle. Point to anything up here on the menu bar, and I'll tell you what it does. Wanna finish? Wanna finish? Newt the Wanna finish? This is a volume control to make it louder or softer. This is your volume control. Click on the arrows to turn it up and down. Wanna finish? Wanna f wanna f wanna fin- This is the toy factory where the professor worked. What fun! That's the supermarket. Yum! This is the magician stage. This is professor's old house. What memories! This is the town where Professor Wise lived as a boy. This is the old apartment house. That's the mysterious pyramid. This will take you back in time to Noah's Ark. This is a birthday party. This is our star school. Click on this to meet the construction crew. A lot of people had way too much fun building this game. This let Click on this to meet the construction crew. A lot of people had way too much fun building this game. This lets you see who they are. This is your player icon. Look for your name right below it to be sure you are playing your game and not someone else's. Newt the Nutri- Ah, what a birthday party that was! Of all the wonderful gifts I received, my pair of x-ray eyes I got was the best present ever! They were in a mysterious package, and I couldn't figure out who had given them to me. 
Well, I realize now just how valuable these special eyes have been to me. You see the word birthday? Well, don't have a cow. Just go to it pronto and click on it now. Nah. Hut one, hut two, hut three, and hike! Did you see the football player named Mike? We used to call him Peepers. See him mixing up a brew? I think I'll pass on drinking that. It's not the thing to do. It took two hours just to make this yummy, scrumptious birthday cake. B is for blue, the color of this, a blue balloon, much too pretty to miss. That's not it. Sorry. Astounding! Great! You've completed your mission! Ah, what a birthday party that was! Of all the wonderful gifts I received, my pair of x-ray eyes I got- That's not it! <laughs> toys, toys, toys! Oh, I could never have enough toys! So I was ecstatic when I got a job in a toy factory. There were so many boxes of toys to ship, but my x-ray eyes helped me make sure that each box had the right toy in it. See an alarm clock that's wrapped up to go. The box is all sealed and it's tied with a bow. If you ask the clown to shake the box he's almost wrapped, you just might find the inline skates, for that is where they're trapped. He's about to be packed in a box like a toy. Can you find where he's snoozing, this tired little boy? Be careful when using these. Those are the rules. They're yours to discover, this big box of tools. When it's time for a break or to signal, day's done, find the whistle that makes a big toot. Here is one. Perform to perfection. Great! You've completed your mission.
Before I got my x-ray eyes, I used to wonder what the cereal prize was like. I'd make quite a mess trying to dig it up. If I had my x-ray eyes back then, finding what I wanted would have been a cinch. I could look for the best prizes. Hey, you have the x-ray eyes. He might be too freaky to eat at your table, because he is a monster and not just a fable. See a T-Rex? It hankers to crunch. It's eating its breakfast inside Monster Munch. Can you find the pears? They're served a la carte. If they get too ripe, those pears fall apart. Newt the Neutrino here, reporting for duty. If you need help, I'm your particle. Point to anything up here on the menu bar. Newt the When you're up so high, the going gets hairy. See a freckle-faced guy? He's the red strawberry. Find him bananas and mix in vanilla. He's there on the box. He's the Mongo Gorilla. Way to go! You did a fine, fine exploring job. Hmm. You'll need... Hmm. You... Hmm. You'll... This is where Marvin the Magician performs. Hocus Pocus, now in focus is Marvin the Magician. I was amazed by all his tricks huh, until I put on my x-ray eyes. Sheesh, I got to see how he did everything. You won't believe what's up his sleeve and in all these other mystic places. They may not be so magic after all, but you know what really is magic? The X-ray eyes. He's happy as a dog. Can you imagine that? This dog is really proud because he wears a hat.
See the magic wand right here that makes enchantment happen. With some secret words, my dear, it does some power zappin'. Oh dear, he's waiting patiently. This parrot wants to be set free. Out from this wizard's top hat might appear a whole bunch of creatures with very big ears. This mummy is shy, so if you don't mind, you'd best let it sleep, or it just might unwind. To perfection! You're becoming quite the explorer. You can go visit my old house. Welcome to my old house. Yep, I grew up in a big house with lots of things going on. I used to love exploring the attic, but now, with my x-ray eyes, I see a lot of stuff I missed. There's hidden stuff everywhere. I can't wait to look around, but you have to help me, okay? They sold the table where once it sat. This lamp says, find out where I'm at. If you... Without him, nothing green would grow. The mighty sun, that's him, you know. This worker once told me that it didn't matter how high he must climb. See him up on the ladder. See the little toy red wagon? It's feeling bored like time is dragging. There on the left, way on up in the sky, you see those two birds? They are there on the fly.
high five to you, winner! You did a fine, fine exploring job. Wow! To have fun here, you'll need a little more practice playing in other places. This apartment house is a busy, busy place. When I got older, I took my x-ray eyes with me to look for an apartment. Oh, what fun I had seeing what kind of neighbors I would have before I chose where to live. Everyone should be so lucky. If it wasn't tied down by this string, yes, it's true, it would fly right away. Why, that's what kites tend to do. One has sausage, one has cheese. Find two pizzas, if you please. you if you owned a limo you'd hire for sure a driver like him who's a fancy chauffeur he isn't a ghost but a monster that's hairy you could call him bigfoot his friends call him larry Goes, Dad, in front of TV. See where he sits in apartment 3B. It's not there. to perfection. Good show, Explorer. You're a success. I delivered papers in this wacky town. To have fun here. One of my first jobs was delivering newspapers all over town. Oh, instead of looking for addresses, I used my x-ray eyes to see inside all the buildings. I didn't even have to get off my bike to see the latest toys or what was happening at the police station. Want to pedal around and find some interesting stuff? Well, come on! Come into their classroom. Their teacher will seat you. They're glad you could come, and they're happy to meet you.
See the hat a fireman wears? Explore the firehouse. Look upstairs. It's not the burger on the sign. Just look inside. This burger's fine. This train's caboose is all that's showing. Do you wonder where this train is going? The produce store is where you're led to find the apple big and red. Five to you, winner! Good show, Explorer! You're a success! Ooh, the mysterious pyramid! Noah's Ark is waiting there to sail away! This is the Star School! Lots of space here! You know, all that exploring I did as a kid paid off. I became a famous archaeologist. I went to Egypt and made discoveries that no one ever dreamed of seeing. You can figure out how that happened, can't you? Well, X-ray eyes, they let me peep through the pyramid walls and uncover the secrets of the pharaohs. Unbelievable. His plane zoomed on a dangerous route, so he jumped out by parachute. Nope, it's not that. This mastodon skeleton bones are kept under the tomb where the mummies slept. His favorite place is by the Nile. He's a giant crocodile. Come on, Jethro. I do tell. I spot me an oil well. Sorry! Oops! Nope, it's not that- Nope! Join the hippo in the Nile and play in the mud a while. Way to go! Good show, Explorer. You're a success.
This will take you back in time to Noah's Ark. My great, 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 oh, really great Uncle Noah was the guy in charge of building this ark. Plus, he had to make sure there were two of every kind of animal on board. Can you imagine how much easier his job would have been keeping track of all those critters if only he had a pair of X-ray eyes? It's going up, so see you later. Find the man-powered elevator. They're in a big hurry. They're not really rude, but pigs are quite hungry. They always want food. These anteaters aren't especially picky. They eat termites, too, with their tongues that are sticky. They'd rather be on river bottoms. These are hippos. Can you spot them? He's got to make sure that no animals missed. You see, he is Noah, and he made up this list. Way to go! You did a fine, fine exploring job. This is the Star School. Lots of space here. Who would have thought that someday we would say that school is out of this world? This school sure is, and that's where I teach today. With kids from around the universe, I fill the space between their ears with all kinds of interesting things. He's the professor. Now, please, wait your turn. There's all kinds of interesting things you will learn. Find the computer the teacher must use. Let's ask how it works, because he will not refuse. They like to use this telescope to see things far away. If you find it quick enough, they might just let you play. A green alien holds this lunchbox. Do you think he likes to munch rock? Nope. Nah. Keep looking! He's a six-legged squeeble who can shimmy and shake. When he's feeling monstrous, he makes the earth quake. Sorry, missed! Performed to perfection! 
Great! You've completed your mission! On this... Click... This is the... This is... On this stage, a magician... Click on the sun to see who created this game. Tim Bro is the digital video editor who helped create these wacky credits. Michelle Light is the animator who designed and created the characters that move around, like me. Danny Ayala is the senior Macintosh engineer who wrote all kinds of special software to make us come to life. Lynn McCarty was the lead lingo engineer on the project. She programmed this game from dawn to dusk. Lauren Morimoto is the production assistant who helped us say the right things. Glenn Stroh provided great graphic production assistance. Tom Pansini is the fine artist who drew all these amazing scenes. So full of fun things, they make your x-ray eyes cross. Donnie Liu was the product marketing manager who made sure that you could have x-ray eyes too. David Finney is the software doctor who made the x-ray and the magnifier work on Windows. Sal Periscandolo is the group manager and script editor who did some writing and arithmetic and saw things through. Steve Lomas is the head designer and project lead for X-Ray and the founding director of Interactive Toys. Terry Barnum recorded and digitized the sounds you hear. Jay Leverson worked some sound magic and helped this game sound just right. Lonnie Manella did all the voices for the characters and wrote the scripts so we know what to say. Jeannie Collins led the testing group looking through everything to see all the glitches she could find. Michelle Jeanette is one of the programmers who helped things work on Windows. Dan Spurn is the managing engineer who provided spiritual guidance to the software team. Brian McManaman is the master painter who painted these faraway places. Son Dao is a designer who helped this game look as good Son Dao is a designer who helped this game look as good as it does. Karen Winter assisted in the administration of this exciting group. Tim Bank is a lingo engineer who helped program this game. Robin Ashley worked with a Windows engineering team. Magician. Dominic Villez is the audio engineer who recorded the sounds you hear. Marvin Dumonchamp provided technical and artistic help to the team. Special thanks to Lori Nichols, who keeps her x-ray eyes on the art group. The people who tested this product were Rob Sablon, Stuart Spilkin, and Randall Williams. David Siebel... David Siebels wrote the background music and the X-Ray theme song.